everyone and welcome back to Calabunga Corner. In this review we are covering a Michelangelo doll. Yes, this is a new Mikey doll that just came out this year from a company called Flophouse. Uh, it's not something you'd find in normal stores. In fact, when I first saw it, it caught my attention from across the hallway. I was over at New York City Comic Con, so you know there's lots of nice, shiny, bright, awesome turtle goodness all around me. And all of a sudden I see... Out of the corner of my eye, this booth with a roof over it. It was this little, like, awesome booth. And, uh, I see Mikey and Raph dolls. So I beeline right over there and start checking these guys out. Just look at him over. He's definitely based off the original cartoon series. We got the M on the belt. We got the colored bandana. Um, but he's missing something. He's missing a wristband. He's got the elbow band, but no wristband. <laughs> And also, it looks like he's just got two things on his hand instead of uh, the three-fingered mitt. Oh, wait. Nope. On the back of the hand, they make up for that. There's the thumb going over the two fingers. So that does actually make sense because his hand is in a fist. Nice to show the detail there. And he's got the shell with the nunchucks on. Uh, no markings of how many toes he has. He is based off the original cartoon series. Meaning he most likely has two toes. So this is a pretty awesome dowel. I, I like it. It's sturdy. It's not just going to fall apart. You can hit it around and it's the same old Mikey. Um, it's not really all that poseable, but it's nice for a decoration or even just having something to sit around and hold when you need something to hold, I guess. Um, I can see kids enjoying it, but it's not a store's. At this point in time, it can be found at conventions, like I found it at New York. Uh, they also had t-shirts, and when you buy a t-shirt from this company, you actually get a pizza box, Ninja Turtle pizza box, that has the size marked on it, and it has the turtle's face on it, and the coloring, and it's pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> I like their different styles of shirts and everything, but I, I really, really did fall for the dolls. I, I wish I could have got both turtles. I hear they have all four, but I haven't seen Don and Leo yet. I really do like their styles, and I found out something. Starting on December 1st, 2014, they will have them for sale on a website, which is www.flophouse.com. So if you're looking to get your hands on these awesome new Ninja Turtle dolls, then go there. This December. This is what I'm talking about. Some pretty awesome stuff. And if you're looking for a gift for a turtle fan who loves the classic series but has everything that you know of, it's not in stores yet. Don't know how many turtle fans have it. So check it out. It would make great for a birthday or Christmas gift, seeing as the holiday seasons are approaching us. I do recommend this. And in the meantime, I, I'm going to just use him as decoration. He's going to be out for a while for everyone to enjoy who comes over to see this unique new Mikey doll. And it does have the flop house tags on there. It does say Nickelodeon. It is an official product. And I really think that I like that it's different. It's different, it's simple, and it's enjoyable. We will catch you here next time on Cowabunga Corner Reviews as I bring out many more toys to show and definitely have more awesome items like this which you can't just normally find in the stores. Hopefully these will make it to the store someday because they're pretty cool. Catch you next time.